After Yugoslavia split apart in 1991, a strong dispute started. Deeply tied to long-standing historical and national identity issues, this conflict centered around the name Macedonia, a term that for the Greeks is associated with a deep historical and cultural significance. For centuries, this name has been synonymous with the ancient kingdom of Macedon, the birthplace of Alexander the Great's empire, and the rich Hellenic heritage of the northern Greek region bearing the same name. Claiming the name of Macedonia was perceived in Greece not just as a diplomatic dispute, but as an existential threat to Greek cultural identity as well as future territorial disputes. This period was marked by tension as millions of Greeks took to the streets in demonstrations of unprecedented scale. Those protests were not just a response to the naming dispute, but a collective outcry against what was seen as an attempt to steal a heritage that Greeks hold dear. Greece's opposition was also fueled by accusations against the Republic of Macedonia for appropriating symbols and figures revered in Greek culture, notably the Virginia Sun and the historical figure of Alexander the Great. From the perspective of North Macedonia, the period following the breakup of Yugoslavia was a time of national rebirth and a quest for international recognition. The choice of the name Macedonia was seen as a fundamental expression of sovereignty and cultural identity. For many in North Macedonia, this name encapsulated their history, language, and aspiration as a distinct Slavic people in the Balkans. This backdrop of historical complexity and national reconciliation set the scene for the Prespa Agreement. The agreement symbolized a pivotal moment of conciliation, paving the way for a new chapter in Greek-Northern Macedonian relations. Grounded in mutual respect and a shared commitment to moving forward amidst the legacies of the past, but let's delve deeper into the details of this agreement. Now, the Prespa Agreement was a key deal between Greece and what was then known as the Republic of Macedonia, or Byram to Greeks. It led to the country changing its name to the Republic of North Macedonia. This renaming, comprehensive in its application, is mandated for use in all domestic spheres, bilateral engagements, and across all regional and international platforms, ensuring uniformity in the country's identification. A significant aspect of the deal is the international acknowledgement of the Macedonian language, recognized under the South Slavic Language Group by the United Nations, and the specification that national would be referred to as Macedonian citizens of the Republic of North Macedonia. Crucially, the agreement delineates a clear distinction between the citizens of North Macedonia and the ancient Hellenic civilization that flourished in what is now Northern Greece. This distinction is further clarified in Article 7, where both nations agree that the terms Macedonia and Macedonian pertinent to distinct historical contexts and cultural heritages. In Greece, these terms are connected to the region's Hellenic civilization, history, and culture, whereas in the Republic of North Macedonia, they relate to its own territory, language, and people with a separate history and culture. Furthermore, the agreement mandates the removal of the Virginia Sun emblem from public use in North Macedonia, symbolizing a commitment to addressing past conflicts. It also establishes a bilateral committee tasked with revising educational materials, including tech textbooks, and maps to eliminate iridescent content. This committee aims to ensure that educational resources in both countries align with UNESCO and Council of Europe standards, fostering a future based on mutual respect and understanding. Transitioning from the core components of the Prespa Agreement, we now turn our attention to its ripple effects, starting with Greece. The Prespa Agreement has had a profound impact on Greece, reflected through various economic, political, and societal lenses. One of the most notable outcomes is the enhancement of bilateral trade and investment flows between Greece and North Macedonia. Based on research conducted by the Institute of Democracy, Societe Civiliscopia, the period following the agreement's implementation witnessed a significant increase in economic activities, bilateral trade surge, marking a positive shift in economic relations. According to the Observatory of Economic Complexity in 2021, 
Greece's exports to North Macedonia reached a total of 1.84 billion. The top exports were refined petroleum, valued at 1.12 billion, followed by electricity at 136 million, and semi-finished iron products at 62 million. Over a span of 26 years from 1995 to 2021, Greece's exports to North Macedonia experienced a substantial growth rate of 15.3% annually, starting from 45 million in 1995 to 1.84 billion in 2021. From a political perspective, the agreement has elevated Greece's standing on the international stage, showcasing its commitment to regional stability and cooperation. This diplomatic achievement has not only improved relations with North Macedonia, but also strengthened Greece's role within the European Union and NATO, underlining its position as a key proponent of Balkan integration into these institutions. The societal impact, however, has been mixed. Initial skepticism and resistance from certain segments of the Greek population have gradually given way to a more nuanced understanding of the agreement's benefits. Surveys conducted as part of the IDSCS research reveal a gradual shift in public opinion. 52% of the Greeks believe that the PRESPA agreement has fostered stability and peace in the Balkans, contrasting with 32% who disagree. This acceptance underscores the argument made by the Greek government at the time, prompting the agreement as a cornerstone for regional compromise and harmony. From the same research, we also underline that if the PRESPA agreement had not been signed, the name Macedonia would likely still be universally used for North Macedonia, according to 53.5% of Greek respondents. In contrast, 34.5% do not support this view. The widespread adoption of Macedonia over former Yugoslav Republic of Macedonia, FIROM, was a significant point for those advocating for the PRESPA agreement, highlighting its importance in addressing naming conventions on the international stage. Moreover, the agreement has revived Greece's advocacy for the European integration of the Western Balkans, aligning with the European Union's aspiration for expansion and stability in the region. As highlighted in publications by the Institute for Human Sciences, the PRESPA agreement serves as a beacon of hope for other nations in the Balkans, proving that long-standing disputes can be resolved through diplomacy, thereby paving the way for a more unified and prosperous Europe. This evolving narrative seamlessly connects to the transformative journey experienced by North Macedonia, which we will explore next. The PRESPA agreement has ushered in a new era for North Macedonia, with significant economic, political, and societal transformations. The agreement's ratification has not only resolved a long-standing name dispute, but also opened doors for North Macedonia's integration into international communities, most notably NATO in 2020, and reinvigorated paths towards European Union membership. This integration represents a monumental shift, highlighting the country's commitment to European standards and its future within the EU. Economically, the impact of the PRESPA agreement on North Macedonia has been substantial, based on research of the Institute for Democracy, Societe Civiliscopia. Trade between North Macedonia and Greece saw an increase signaling stronger economic ties. According to Observatory of Economic Complexity in 2021, North Macedonia's exports to Greece amounted to 289 million. Leading the export list were raw tobacco, which accounted for 44.9 million, followed by electricity at 25.7 million and knit t-shirts at 21.9 million. Over a period of 26 years from 1995 to 2021, the export value from North Macedonia to Greece grew at an annual average rate of 9.98%, escalating from 24.4 million in 1995 to 289 million in 2021. This economic bond is crucial for North Macedonia's growth, offering access to broader markets markets and encouraging foreign investment. The political landscape in North Macedonia has also been positively affected. The agreement facilitated the country's NATO membership, a significant achievement that enhances its security and international standing. The prospect of EU membership bolstered by the agreement is driving political and institutional reforms in North Macedonia, aligning with European norms and standards. 
This process is instrumental in fostering governance, democracy, and rule of law, essential pillars for the country's development. Societally, the agreement has had a mixed reception. While some view it as a necessary compromise for national progress, others remain attached to historical sentiments However, the overall perception is gradually shifting towards a more positive outlook, recognizing the benefits of international recognition and integration. Surveys indicate that the public leans toward the belief that this agreement has indeed bolstered regional peace and stability. Nonetheless, a substantial minority, over one-third of the populace, disagrees with this view. The divergence points to a significant gap between the agreement's international support and its reception among a notable segment of North Macedonia's citizens highlighting the complexities surrounding its acceptance. Looking to the future, the PRESPA agreement opens a horizon of opportunities for both Greece and North Macedonia, promising economic revitalization, political cohesion, and cultural integration. The economic renaissance expected in the coming years is underpinned by the agreement with trade and investment between the two nations further flourishing. Economic interdependence is a driving force for regional growth, providing a foundation for sustained prosperity. The political landscape is also poised for positive change, with the agreement facilitating deeper bilateral and regional cooperation North Macedonia's continued journey towards EU membership, supported by Greece, exemplifies the potential for integration and unity within the Balkans. This political and social harmony is essential for fostering a stable and prosperous region. Cultural and educational exchanges between the two nations offer avenues for building mutual understanding and respect. Initiatives such as joint academic programs and cultural festivals will strengthen the bonds between the people of Greece and North Macedonia, highlighting the transformative power of education and culture in bridging divides. The youth of both countries emerge as pivotal actors in the new era, driving innovation and fostering social change. Their active participations in shaping a shared future underscores the dynamic potential of the PRESPA agreement to transcend generations. As we conclude our exploration of the PRESPA agreement, it's clear that this historic accord has not only resolved a long-standing dispute, but also charted a course for a future filled with promise and potential for Greece and North Macedonia. The journey ahead is complex, yet the foundation of cooperation and mutual respect established by this agreement provides a roadmap for navigating the challenges together. Thank you for joining us on this insightful journey. If you enjoyed our video, we encourage you to like and subscribe to our channel. Your engagement helps us create content that illuminates the complexities of our world, fostering a community of informed and active viewers.